Welcome to Affinity Photo. This is a short and sweet video on quick masks. Now, quick masks enable you to create a selection by painting onto a layer mask. It's very easy and very quick to do. So to toggle the quick mask feature, I'll simply click up here. And now that we have this red overlay on our image, we can paint in our selection. So what we want to do is select the paintbrush tool, Let's zoom into our image, and as we hover our mouse over the areas, we'll get a preview, and this will tell us where we'll be painting our selection. So we want to select these eyes. Let's take the hardness of the brush down all the way, zoom in a bit further, increase the brush size, and we'll just click drag to paint on this layer mask, like so. Move across to the other eye, and do the same. Okay, so if we zoom out, we can then use the shortcut to toggle the quick mask on and off. And once it's off, we'll see our marquee selection that we've just created. We can toggle it back on, and if we wish, we could continue painting onto this mask. We also have, from this drop-down, different options for how our mask is displayed. But we'll go back to overlay for now. So if we come out of quick mask mode, we can then simply apply any adjustment or filter that we want. So I'll go for an HSL adjustment and bump the saturation up. I'll then deselect the selection. And through the quick mask feature, I've very easily isolated the owl's eyes and increased their saturation. Using quick masks is such an advantage in this case. Just to demonstrate, if we were to use the selection brush to try and select the eyes, we would then have to do more work to get an accurate selection. So you can see quick masking is incredibly useful. So there's a short overview of quick masks. If you have any questions or queries, please feel free to ask on the official Affinity forums. Thank you for watching.